All right, bite doing this, Mike Sykes, Millionaire Maker. Hang with me, I'll make you a millionaire. All right, so this is day 182 of my 365-day YouTube content creation challenge, where I challenge myself for the next 365 days to create valuable and useful content that I can post to my YouTube channel and try and help bring the benefit of the knowledge that I've gained over the last few years to somebody out there that might need, that could use the benefit, that could use the knowledge that I've gained, okay, as an entrepreneur. Uh, now, so if you're watching this video, I appreciate it if you go ahead and hit the thumbs up. Also, hit the subscribe button, and if you can, possibly share this video with at least five people. I appreciate that. Okay, it's $9. This is what I made today at Papa John's. What the hell? Oh, snap. Looky, looky, I was looking for you. This is what I made yesterday. <laughs> The one made yesterday, which was eighty dollars. This is what I made today, which was nine dollars. Now, partially that reason is because I barely worked today. I think I made. I think I did two runs at Papa John's today because I have an abscess right here in my mouth. It's about that giant. Okay. You probably can't see it. Mm, let's see. Ah, uh, there you go, right there. Right there. Uh huh. Right, right there. That's an abscess. And today it was hurting so bad that ooh, I, I couldn't take it no more. I popped about fifteen of these. The Proxins went and bought me some uh, oil gel. This is stuff with, uh, I think it's supposed to be like uh, olive oil. I think that's what it was. It was in that movie. Uh, I can't think of the movie. It's long, probably long before y'all time um, with Dustin Hoffman. I think it was The Running Man, something like that. Let me see. If I can look up Dustin Hoffman, I say, go there. Yeah. Oh, I ain't found that. Yeah. How about the tape gun? Well, I'll do it. Make sure I get it in there tomorrow. Uh, Dustin Hoffman. Dustin Hoffman. But it was a movie that he was in, right? And the man had him. The dentist, the doctor had him strapped in a chair and he was fucking with his teeth. And he had some olive oil like this or something like that, right? And like he was drilling drill a hole in his teeth and he was like making it hurt and he was asking him questions. He was like, is it safe? Is it safe? And like he'd take that bottle and dip a thumb on it and rub it on there and sit and make the pain go away. You know? So I went and got some of that. I've been... Dousing my shit with that all day. I'm trying to see what, uh, I can, it was an old movie. I mean, I'm finna hold on. Uh, Marathon Man, that's what it was, 1976. I was 13 years old. Mm hmm. Yeah, that's what it was. Dr. Haddam and shit. Is it safe? Is it safe? I remember that. Uh. Oh. So, I'm going to try and hit this clinic early in the morning. My mama says first come, first serve. So, I'm going to try and hit that one right quick and see if they can do anything for me. Give me something, bust this member, got something, anything. Because, I mean, it was seriously hurting so bad today that um, I honestly contemplated going to the emergency room. But after rubbing so much of this on it and popping so many of these, you know, it started to ease up after I left work. You know, so I did a little door dash. I think I made about thirty something dollars door dash, and I have to look after I finish this video so I can write it down. Okay, and then after that, you know, I just came home and 
Ooh, did it look clean up? I can feel this thing. It's like a big ass marble on the inside. But luckily, right now, it's not hurting as much. I managed to um, get a can of tuna fish down. Okay. Uh, oh, yeah. I ended up having, uh, got the white truck back. Got the white truck back today. It didn't, wasn't nothing like what I thought it was. The problem was, he said the belt, um, yeah. Uh, it had the front crank, crankshaft seal. Okay. That's what was wrong. That's where the oil leak was coming from. The belt had came off. Okay. I guess it was the serpentine belt, I guess. And so by the belt coming off, that wasn't turning the, um, air con the air conditioner pump. So it wasn't no air, okay? So when he replaced the belt, which cost $27, when he replaced the belt, that made the air work, and he replaced the crankshaft seal, which was $34, and it was $160 labor to replace the seal, and the oil change, which was $40, $36, dollars okay, almost for you. So for a total of $282, that is what it costs to fix the truck, okay? So now the truck is fixed. Um, my air went out yesterday. I did a little tap on it, it came back on. By the time I got finished with work and everything, it went all the way out again, and so, I went up there today. Yeah, I, went, I took it up there to have him see if there was something that he could do with it to fix it. And that's when he told me, hey, uh, here's your truck. This is what the truck is down. It's through. Blah, blah, please. So what I did was I swapped out the truck for my car. Jenny took the truck. I took the red car and went to work. Okay, so... I figured by Monday, we well, probably have the truck done tomorrow because it don't take nothing to do to blow a motor. It's all right. Since I bought the motor, oh, I left that. That's what I left in the car. But since I bought the motor, uh, I think it's up there with the car. And it was seventy dollars for the motor. I mean, the blow a motor from the pulling part, and it's just gonna be his labor for putting it in. Okay. Oh. Uh, right quick, let you know, today was Friday, so stock market was open. I think it'll be closed Monday in observance of the 4th of July, which is Sunday, because today is Saturday the 3rd, 4th of July, it's going to be Sunday. And everything is going to be in observance Monday, okay? But the stock market was open today, and... A lot, few things were down, few things were up. Okay, uh, not much. Like clean. Remember, I went back and I bought a couple more shares, and I had bought them, bought in at like um, clean is one of those. I really believe it's gonna take off. Matter of fact, I know it it got to take off because I am seriously putting money into clean because like every time it dips down lower and lower, like my average cost now is at 1136. And it's because it's like this here. Um uh let's how we do this. We do this like this here. First time I bought in. Okay. Do this. First time I bought in, I bought in 47.36 divided by 4. And I bought in at, can I get a pen? 1184 share for four shares. Okay. And then the next time I bought in, it was 46, 46.84 divided by Four more shares, which was eleven seventy one. Okay, so I bought eleven seventy one for four more shares, which was lower than the eleven eighty four. Not much, but lower. Okay, and then I turn around. And I bought for thirty point eighty one divided by 
three. I turned back around and bought three more shares at $10.27, 10 $10.27 a share, okay? So now what we would do is we're going to take that equals 10.27 plus uh, 11.71. No, that ain't going to work like that. Okay, we got... Oh, okay, hold on. Uh, no, what we do is clear that. And then we go 4, 8, nine, 10, 11. We go um, what we got. Where is it at? It's at. Our market share is at 1. I don't think that's how I get it. That's not how I get it. I have to figure this one out. Divide it by. Divided by uh, what I got eleven shares. No, that's nine ninety six a share. That's what it's that's what it's selling for now, right? So, okay, let's do this one here. Clear it out, and we go back down here to actually what we paid, which would be forty seven point thirty six plus. 46.84 plus 30.81, 30 30.81. 30 you fucked up somewhere. <laughs> I really did on that one, but that's say $30,000. Okay, $30.81 plus. 46.84 plus 47.36 equal 105. I mean, yeah, 125.01 divided by, I got 11 shares equal my um, market average cost is $11.36 a share. Okay, so let's see. Right now it's at 11.36 a share. Now let's say I bought mm, four more shares. Let's say I bought four more shares at 9.96. Clear that. 9.96 times four would be 39.84. Then I would add that to I forgot what my total price was. Then I would add that to clear. Because I didn't write it down. 30.87 plus 46.84 plus. 47.36 equal, that ain't what you got the first time, 125.01 is what you got the first time. So let's do this again, five for 11. Right, so how you get a seven, it's gonna be 01. Okay, we came out with 125.01 and then minus 0.06. That's going to give us our 2501. Then we would add the 3984. 39.84, which would give us that. Now, what is the 39? How many more shares do we buy? 9, 18, 18. What did we buy? How many more shares do we buy? Okay, wait, wait a minute. What's the 164? Oh, 39.84. Okay. About three shares. 
We're just gonna put something in there. Okay. Oh, oh, we go here. Three shares. Nope. So it would be four shares. Right. Four shares would be thirty nine eighty four. One twenty five oh one, which is the three, okay, which is the four, which is so then okay, go up, which is the equal, then we would divide it by we bought four more shares, we bought four more shares, which would give us fifteen, which would be divided by divided by fifteen, which would bring the average share down from ten thirty six to I mean, from 11.36 to 10.99 is here. All right. Well, we might end up doing that before we uh anywhere. Giving us a nice round 15 shares. Okay. Fuel cell energy. What is this? Hmm. In the last month, past month, we went down, like way down. Okay, so, yeah, they saying that, but it might not be. So we're gonna go back to our portfolio. Oh, did I tell you what the crypto was? Mm. Oh, okay, so like I was telling you, a few things went down, like clean. Uh, AMC went down, but it's still selling at fifty-two dollars a share. Um, GE went down like sixty cent. GE is what? Let me see where's GE at. I'm like Dr. Boyce, maybe GE maybe needs to be something I need to be looking into. Yeah, thirteen dollars a share, and it pays dividends too. So maybe this is the one I need to be buying more shares of instead of um. Messing around with that other one. Because actually in the last month, yeah, it has went down 5%. Uh, last three months, it went down 1%. 1.4%. All right. So... But I'm saying, I'm thinking the GE might be something that I might want to spend a little bit more money and start buying a few more shares of GE. Okay? Right now, my average cost is ten ninety five, but it's selling at $13. Okay? But I can start looking into it. Okay? Um, I wanted to talk a little bit about the things that's going on. But right now, I don't think I do. Right now, really, what I think I want to do is go ahead, go to bed, because it's 1.30. I got to get up in the morning. I seriously do need to get up. Okay. So I'm going to go ahead. How you doing, Bella? I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to end this video. I appreciate y'all being here with me tonight. My name is Michael Sykes, the Millionaire Maker. If you hang with me, I make you a millionaire. I'll see you tomorrow. Peace.